Hey guys, I'm making this quick video just as a quick tip on something that I find very, very cool. And I know it helps me a lot day to day and I know it's gonna help you a lot as well. So if you guys never came across this tool, voicenotes.com, um, they're on currently on a lifetime deal, $50 lifetime deal. I don't think it's gonna last too long. They have around 20,000 people subscribed, but the free version is also decent so you can still you can still use a free version but each voice no is uh limited to one minute uh but uh if you get the lifetime deal then i think each voice note is limited to 30 minutes um although you can continuously make voice notes so what it really is is um it's a voice note they have a mobile app as well but you can use a browser as well and you just talk into it and then it transcribes your uh, your audio i think it uses whisper api um, and then what it does is it uses any um, underlying AI model, like large language models, such as you know chat, GPT-4, GPT-4 O, or Claude 3, or any one of those ones. Um, I don't think you, I, I don't think you can choose which one you want, but it does it for you. Um, and so the nice thing is you can use. Uh, they have, and I'll show you guys how I do it. it it's already powerful. Just in just just doing that is very powerful. Um, but when you combine it with Todoists. Uh, it, it gets very, very pow powerful. Now, I'll show you guys what I mean. Um, also, just uh, some background on this company, this tool. The, the guys who founded this tool are also the founders of Buy Me A Coffee, which is a pretty well-known uh, uh, tool where you can you, know, you can sort of start a funding page. And a lot of YouTubers use this, actually, where you know it's just like a sort of a donation, kind of donation tool. So people use this. And so th these these guys are sort of well known. It's it's not it's not nobody. It's like someone who has sort of um, established themselves. Um, so now just to get to it, I just want to show you guys this really. So imagine like imagine you wake up in the morning and you just want to uh, talk into the mic and just talk about what you want to do for the day, just to get things out of your mind. So imagine it's like 8 a.m. I wake up from bed and I'm like, you know what, this is what I'm gonna do. Um, I want to, and so I started the recording just so you know, and I usually try to start off with the day just to give the voice note a little bit more context. So I'll say something like, Hey, it's June 2nd, 2024, 8 AM. Just start the voice note that way. These are the tasks that I have to do for the rest of the day. Um, I'm going to go for a walk for 30 minutes, um, at, uh, 10 AM, uh, and then at 12 PM, uh, I'm going to go to the gym for one hour. Um, and then from two to 3 PM. I'm gonna work on, do some client work and uh, build the homepage for client X. Um, and then from four to 6 p.m. I'll be at my parents just to you know have some family time. And then from eight to 10 p.m. I'll do some administrative tasks for my business. And what you do is you click on done and what it's now doing is it's uploading the audio, which you know if it's not that long, it, it won't take too long. Um, it transcribes the whole thing and as you can see it transcribes the whole thing and what's really cool is like it can find previous Related notes that you've done over time in the past it can do that But what's really cool is now you can there's a couple things you can tag it you can edit it now You can actually go in and edit th this um, the transcript um, You can also share and all that stuff uh, Regenerate the transcript etc 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 but what I like to do is I like to go to create and I like to click on to do list. And so what it does is it takes everything you've mentioned in the voice note and it turns it into a to do list. So line by line item. And so it, it did that, right? So for example, if I go back here, uh, if I click on to do list, you know, go to go for a walk for 30 minutes, 10 a.m., et cetera, et cetera. And then what I'll do is I'll copy this. And what's really cool is if you go to to do list and just start any new task or within the task itself. Say for example, I'm just showing you guys as, as a subtask. So say I created a subtask, I just copied that whole list, I'm pasting it. And what Todoist does is it's asking me if I want to take all those tasks, I think there were five tasks, and do I want it to? Do I want it as one task or do I want it as five tasks? And I'll say like, I want it as five tasks. And what's really cool is Todoist has natural language um, and so you can see, like, for example, it's scheduled, and this is connected to my Google, uh, Google Calendar. So on my calendar, it'll show tomorrow. I mean, you should explain it. Like, The best way for to-do is to know it's today rather than tomorrow, because 10 already passed. It's actually 2.41 p.m. Uh, that's why you can see, like, 
3 p.m., 6 p.m. because 10 a.m. is already done. But anyways, imagine it's the day start start of the day. So yeah, go for a walk. It'll show on my calendar. Go to the gym for one hour, 12 p.m. Does it sh show for one hour? Usually if it doesn't show for one hour, you can always click on this and then you can set up a duration for one hour right there. Um, it's not too difficult. So yeah, I guess sometimes it doesn't, yeah, it doesn't show that full duration, so you might actually have to fix it. But look, it's really cool. So imagine you have like a list of 15 or 20 tasks instead of putting it into, you know, Todoist. I think this is very powerful if you if you use Todoist. Um, if you use another tool, the process might be a little bit different. But I really like Todoist just because it's very simple for task management. I use Notion and other tools in the past before, but I think this is very, very cool. You know, you can go in and add some notes and, and you know, check it out throughout the day, but it's very, very cool. So hope you guys like that tip and hope you guys implement some of this in your day-to-days as well. Thank you.